Stewart, there was a lot at stake tonight. It was a great match on paper. Two former world champions. You as the defending champion. Sean's lifted the Masters before. Uh, not surprising that, that it was, you know, perhaps a touch nervy at times. Yeah, we, we, I'll say uh, we both may, may probably give each other a bit too much respect. Um, I think we was both waiting for, for both of us to start playing well. And uh, there were some good parts and obviously bad misses. And yeah, I think it had li literally pretty much everything. And uh, yeah, obviously the balls sort of sometimes went a bit scrappy and it's hard to sort of play well under them conditions. But uh, yeah, obviously absolutely over the moon to uh, beat Sean and get another semis. And two key frames, you could have gone into the mid-sesh, 3-1 down, but you're two apiece, so the fourth was big, and so too the eighth to move 5-3 ahead. Yeah, that, 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 that's what makes that all the difference. Um, so I, I thought I was actually 3-1 down, obviously I had it in my head, and when he left me a chance, I sort of looked at the scoreboard and I was like, oh, it's only still 2-1, I've got a chance here. And uh, yeah, uh, obviously our, our things happened, obviously made a good uh, made a good clearance, and then uh, obviously Nick the Nick the frame, it, it meant everything. And uh, obviously then winning the next two after the break to go forward to um, a bit of a, I think a topsy-turvy frame to go 4-3 and, and then say, obviously winning that, that eight frame, it, it just obviously put me in a driving seat. And it seems as though you're getting to grips with the Masters now because it, it took you a little while to settle into this competition. A few years where you were going out very early you're into your third semi-final, but your second in succession. And how much confidence will you take into the match against either Jan Bingtao or Stephen Maguire, knowing that you've gone all the way and lifted it because you're the defending champion? Yeah, um, obviously I'm, I'm still in it, and obviously I'm, I'm improving. I think as, as the game's gone on, and uh, to, or to come for a battle with Sean, uh, yeah, of course I'll, I'll get some confidence out of it. And whoever I play Saturday. Um, Jan Bintel or Maguire, it'll be a tough game and I may probably need to play a little bit better and improve my game and uh, hopefully, yeah, hopefully get through another final. Does it feel as though you're approaching your best form because it has been a sort of yeah, kind of lukewarm season by your own high standards, but does it feel like things are clicking here this week at Milton Keynes? Um, no, not, not more than anything that like I've done all season. Um, I've been scoring better in, in tournaments or in matches. Um, I just feel like I'm pretty sharp at the moment. Obviously, we had the Championship League last week and I think that's helped to sort of get my game in shape. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll say, I just need to sort of maybe probably relax and uh, let my game come out. And uh, so hopefully, uh, obviously do that Saturday. Well, enjoy your day off tomorrow and we'll see you in the semis. Well done, Stuart. Thanks a lot. Cheers.